like to welcome everybody to Crow's Nest Regional Art Gallery. Um, I'd like to congratulate Bill on putting together this amazing exhibition spanning his whole career from what, the early 70s? Late 70s. Late 70s? Okay. <laughs> Late 70s um, through to I think it was 2014, one uh, of these. Something. Yeah, something. Yeah. detailing and the contrasting approaches. Now, um, there's some interesting pieces in the middle of the wall across here. There's a very controlled study of a placid landscape, that's I think it's Lake, Lake Apex, um, second from the left there at the top. Um, and below that is the sort of the starkness of a post-apocalyptic treed Canberra landscape before, uh, below it. And this was done just um, after the fires four years ago. Uh, no, more, sorry, 12. 13 years ago. I perhaps should comment on the fact that there is a preponderance of this painting technique in the room. And that's because it, it, it came out of, shall we say, some very painful grey pains experienced in London as a student in the 70s. I was very, very lucky, very privileged, and in fact that's also probably important to mention, that as a student I was able to study under some really very, very fine artists. And two of them, in, two, three of them in particular, one I studied with in Brisbane in the late 60s, and the two that I studied with in the UK in the early 70s, are probably more than anybody more responsible for this legacy that I live with of my passion for drawing and my belief in its importance in everyday art practice. And they've probably been more responsible than just about anybody for my pursuing of that and for honing my skills and developing my knowledge and, and of course <coughs> expertise and interest and knowledge of things like composition and design which are very, very important. Thank you. 